I got in my hand two TCL 10 devices. There is the 10 uh, L and the 10 Pro. Um, it's part of TCL Mobile's push into that mid-market space doing very good quality smartphones, but at a price that is much more affordable than what you'd expect. To talk more about that, I thought we'd chat with Sam Skontos from TCL Mobile. How are you today, Sam? I'm really well, how are you doing? I'm, I'm good. Now look, um, I'm going to talk to about both these handsets to you while I've got you uh, today. Um, but a lot of people wouldn't have heard about TCL before. I mean, probably heard about the TVs, but not necessarily their smartphones. Where are you positioning the TCL smartphone in the market and who are you trying to target? Yeah, well, we, uh, we've been very, very uh, strong in the Australian market at the entry level with the Alcatel brand. So it's time for us to get into the mid-tier segment of the market uh, where these uh, TCL smartphones are positioned. So what do we mean by the mid-tier? We basically mean over $300 and under $1,000. Uh, unfortunately, it's become a bit like that nowadays where some people would question where $1,000 is actually mid-tier. But when you have products that are over $2,000, then it really does make that $1,000 mark uh, um, really uh, mid-tier. Um, we are targeting people that are the, sh the smart savvy uh, technology enthusiasts. The guys that want all the latest and greatest uh, technology, but really are smart enough to say, I'm not, I'm not spending over $1,000 for it. Mm -hmm. and, and they're the sort of people we, we are targeting. The specs that you've got in these devices, I notice were in smartphones $1,800 probably two years ago, especially. I mean, um, some of the some of the some of the specs were even in, in in price devices above that. Uh, is that what you're trying to do? Are you trying to sort of say to the customer, look, if you're if you're prepared to wait a little bit, you know, eighteen months, two years, that kind of thing, um, you can potentially get a discount of half to more than half uh, the price of that top of the line AAA smartphone that you're seeing announced today. Uh, if you get one of these TCL devices. Is that sort of the message? Uh, it's partly the message. Uh, the, the message is you, you don't need to spend over $1,000 to get some of the features that you normally expect to have with those premium handsets. Uh, at the same time, um, we look around to see what technology is around and available so we can build a lot of value into our phones. Um, but, you know, things like the display, which uh, we actually uh, manufacture ourselves through a sister company, um, the, the display is really top-notch and is, is as good as what you'll get in the market today. Most of the other things like potentially the chipset, potentially some of the other uh, elements of the, the handset, yes, uh, but the display, the audio, the cameras, the video capability – mixed and coupled with our own technology called Next Technology and XT Technology, which gives you a lot more enhancements of both the video, the quality of the video, of the display and the, the audio uh, and the camera. Um, they are top of the line uh, technology that's available today. Starting with the 10 Pro, we sent Sara uh, from CyberShack TV out with the 10 Pro and the 10L um, to a local park, take photos, that kind of thing. And... We were looking at the 10 Pro with the quad camera at the back. Uh, it's it's really quite a nice smartphone. And look, using Sarah as the barometer, she actually thought it was a much more expensive phone than um, 750 bucks. Is, is that sort of the response that you get when people look at this and think, well, they expect to pay more? Yeah, very much so. Um, it's interesting you say that because I think a lot of Pro in their hands, they generally – I'm extremely surprised that uh, the product is at 749 and, uh, you know, for such a product with the curved display, with the, the quad cam uh, configuration of the camera. And we got some amazing technology in there, especially around the video stabilisation and autofocus um, technology that really um, you'd expect it to pay upwards of uh, $1,500. And, uh, yeah, it, it does have a, a premium look and feel 
Um, but it's also got some really good features and, and technology that, um, you know, if it wouldn't be out of place uh, in, in a $1,500 uh, price point. Yeah, it is It is a really nice – it's one of those things, Sam, when, when I pick up a phone and it's in my hand, it can very easily feel cheap, right? You, you, you know the feeling. You've been in the smartphone business for a very long time. You can actually feel um, – a, a premium finish with the curved display and the backing and the and, and the weight of it and it, and it definitely feels like something that you um that you that you could expect to pay a lot more money for with with the 10 l you've got a second smartphone it's a little bit bigger than the 10 pro but you've actually brought this one in at what is it 450 dollars is the plan to say okay 450 bucks you can get this but hey you know you can actually spend a little bit more money get the quad camera get this get this get this there's a few extra things for spending up a bit just giving people a choice yeah it, it is a matter of choice um at the same time we feel that um what is lacking in that mid-tier smartphone market is a good entry level of this of the the mid-tier so this is positioned at under 500 dollars um, we've picked um, two price points within the mid-tier uh, that we'd like to get under. Uh, one of them is uh, $500 and the other one's $800. And really, we are still using the NXT, to, uh, the next technology for um, uh, the displays and the cameras on both devices. It's just the display on the 10L is not an AMOLED display. It doesn't have that richness and saturation um, that you get on an AMOLED display. But nonetheless, it's a full HD plus display. It's got a really good camera configuration and all the technology that we have in the 10 Pro is implemented to, to 10L at just a slightly lower level. Mm. And um, you still, for value for money, it is phenomenal at 449 what you get for it. So we're just trying to have two price points within the mid-tier segment of the market, one being an entry, under five hundred dollars at four forty nine, and the other one under eight hundred dollars at seven forty nine. Just talking about um, the accessories and um, well, not accessories, but um, enablement of extra um, connected devices. I did notice that you've got the three and a half mil jack on both devices. Thank you for doing that. It really, it really does help when you want to hand your phone to the kids or something like that, and you can just put a plug in the headphones and give it to them and then all of a sudden they're able to watch that cartoon or whatever it was that they wanted to watch. But also I noticed with the Bluetooth on there, you've got the ability to connect up to four sets of Bluetooth headphones, I believe, at the one time. What's the, what's the reason for doing that? So, yeah, I mean, we are utilising Bluetooth 5.0 and, um, you know, uh, as you would know, with Bluetooth 5.0, you can actually connect two devices, Bluetooth devices at the same time. We've enhanced that and we've decided that we need more than two devices, we need four devices. So you can connect on both the TCL handsets, uh, smartphones, um, up to four devices via Bluetooth. Now, that can be headphones, Bluetooth headphones, could be Bluetooth speakers. Mm. And, and we believe that um, in an environment of sharing, and we're all sharing everything from photos, videos, and, and music files, etc. Um, we feel that the togetherness of having, you know, up to, up to a whole family sharing um, uh, content is uh, is the way to go. So that's why we've added uh, up to four devices. So they're available now, I believe, and you're going through retailers like JB Hi-Fi and Officeworks and places like that, so you've chosen mass market locations for people to choose them. Uh, is it available now or coming soon? Oh, it's available now. Uh, people can buy them online right now, uh, and uh, there, there'll be limited stock in store, but you can buy it online, no problem. Okay. All right, brilliant. TCL, um, the mid-market smartphone, that is definitely uh, making a big splash. Two models. The... 10L at 449, and then they've also got the TCL 10 Pro at um, 749. Uh, worth a look. Have a look at these ones. There's some good features in them, and I'll tell you what, a lot of bang for buck. Sam Skontos from TCL Mobile, uh, thank you for your time today. Good to have a chat once again about what you're doing in the smartphone business. Thanks, Charlie. It's always a pleasure, mate.